as far as uh, furniture and things like that, it's concerned, we didn't have anything like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Almost the old second hand or junk mm -hmm. and uh, ice box. Mm -hmm. type, you put ice on top, and that was about it. So we really didn't have very much. When the war started, uh, they, this time they had the, what do you call the second hand dealers. Mm -hmm. They had they came <coughs> with a wagon with a horse. You saw running with the horse and wagon in terms of at that time. And they, were, and they used to buy things. I remember one thing in San Francisco is just around the corner from us, there used to be one person that used to own an electric car. That's the only car, electric car I remember. Uh, so we did live in a horse stable. Mm -hmm. And uh, they built some new houses in the infield. Those were new, but then the ones we slept in was in the, bar, uh, the horse stable. Mm -hmm. They added a front part and uh, they whitewashed it. And some of the stall had the opening <laughs> to the next stall, and you see teeth mark up there. <laughs> and some of the top part was open. You know, just a, you know, just a regular stable before. Uh, a to me, going camp was a lot of fun. I had no responsibility, you see. <laughs> really? I didn't lose anything, really. And I made new friends in camp. So to me, it was a, a lot of fun. I had no worries, no. Not 17, uh, yeah. yeah. I think that my parent generation, yeah, they lost a lot. They had a lot of problems moving, packing things like that. But to me, I had nothing to do with it. So to me, it was just a blast. Meet new friends <laughs> and uh, much bigger social circle. So it, I really enjoyed it. Okay.